We need strawberries, mm -hmm. eggs, milk, and, ooh, candles. Christine tweeted, that's the way to handle a boss. Stefan rocks. Wish I could compel my boss to give me a raise. And Arielle Cabell tweeted, I think Lexi would approve of Stefan's girl. Too bad she's dead in a trunk. Upside, this qualifies her to guest host on TVD Rehash. Aw, thanks, Arielle. So this is what they mean by the other side. Welcome to the Vampire Diaries Rehash presented by AT&T. I'm Emily Chang and it is so great to be out of that trunk and here in the Rehash studio to highlight the best of what you had to say about this week's episode of TVD. And from the looks of it, y'all really enjoyed Elena's little party down at the swimming hole. And it's a perfect dive for Elena. Unicorn Dog tweeted, the CW knows how to do pool parties. First. Elena's abs, on point. And second, Jeremy, what the hell? Dude, stop. It was a fun party, Zari. Well, maybe not the part where they found out that compulsion doesn't work anymore. So Sarah, the girl you attacked and you compelled? Knows what I am. Or when that guy, Jay, tried to kill Stefan. Oh, and they kept running out of ice. There's no ice. Go get ice. Weren't you getting ice? I thought I told Enzo to go get more ice. That was Caroline's ice. Tanya tweeted, he is protective of his boo, even her ice. Now, in addition to Corenzo, the breakfast buddies, if you like your TVD ships, this episode launched a whole fleet of them. Sad jocks are kind of like sad clowns. <laughs> They're pathetic, but kind of hilarious. Penelope Mitchell tweeted, Lyler is good. I think I could do Lyler. Hear that, guys? It's happening! And newcomer Liam, a.k.a. Cute Brag, kissed Elena, and Joe immediately tweeted, Paws off, Liam. The SS Steriline may be in danger of running aground, but you wouldn't know it from your comments this week. Do you have feelings for him or something? Yeah, I think maybe I did. Ashley tweeted, No, Caroline, you did not. You do, you do have feelings for him. And back in 1994 Mystic Falls, it's... Damero! That's my car. That's my car! Helena tweeted, Damero is my new OTP! Aww, aren't they cute together? And Bonnie and Damon have discovered the mystery crossword finisher, and sorry, Emma, the answer is much less cuddly. It's, uh, Kai. It's gonna be a problem. <laughs> Emmy tweeted, Who is this little twerp? I have a new reason to hate pork rinds. Kai is hot. The bad thing is that he's evil. Well, Kat, the good thing is, Bonnie's got her groove back. Hell yes, witch status! Hell yeah, Abby! Now that they have Kai under control, we'll see if he really has a way home or not. You better hurry before Enzo becomes the next load of mulch in Tripfell's creepy vampire murder van. Turns out, red mulch stains. Who knew? Yeah, you know what else stains, Trip? Dead bodies. Jenny tweeted, Oh God. Oh God, Enzo! Stefan, what's wrong with you? I have my own way. I like them to die. Just make sure it's painful. Never thought I could dislike Stefan. The day has come. Someone save Enzo! Save Enzo, huh, Andrea? You guys did see what he did to Ivy, right? It's okay, it's okay, I mean, I get it, he's charming. Just saying, my character spent all episode in a trunk. That's all. Well, okay, seriously, I had a lot of fun reading all your great comments this week, so be sure to keep them coming our way on hashtag TVD. You can also follow me on Twitter at Chihuahua. Thanks for watching. I'm gonna go find some ice. Pork rinds. Not on the list, and ew. I'm gonna leave you with a parting thought from Alex, who tweeted, Damon and Bonnie shopping. Quick question, when they get what they want, do they just walk right out of the store or fake buy it? Personally, i totally fake buy. I mean, who wouldn't want to play grocery store in a real grocery store? Just saying. Let us know what you think of our show in the comments below and click here for more TVD Rehash. Bye.